In this video, we have given that 2 to the power x minus 4 whole cube plus 4 to the power x minus 2 whole cube is equal to 4 to the power x plus 2 to the power x minus 6 whole cube. So here, if I assume 2 to the power x minus 4, 2 to the power x minus 4 is a and 4 to the power x minus 2, 4 to the power x minus 2 is b. Then 4 to the power x plus 2 to the power x minus 6, 4 to the power x plus 2 to the power x minus 6, it will be a plus b, it is a plus b. So we get a q plus b q is equal to a plus b whole cube and now we have a q plus b q and a plus b whole cube is equal to a q plus b q plus 3 a b times a plus b and now a q and a q will get cancelled and b q and b q also get cancelled and we get 3 a b times a plus b is equal to 0 or a b times a plus b is equal to 0 and now from here we can get three equations one is either a is equal to 0 or either b is equal to 0 or either a plus b is equal to 0 and now we have a is equal to 2 to the power x minus 4 and b is equal to 4 to the power x minus 2 and a plus b is equal to 4 to the power x plus 2 to the power x minus 6. We have a is equal to 2 to the power x minus 4 that is 0 and b is equal to 4 to the power x minus 2 that is 0 and a plus b is equal to 4 to the power x plus 2 to the power x minus 6 that is 0. So from first equation we get 2 to the power x is equal to 4 or 2 to the power x is equal to 4 is 2 square so we get x is equal to 2 and from second equation we get 4 to the power x is equal to 2 or 4 to the power x is equal to 2 is 4 to the power 1 by 2 so we get x is equal to 1 by 2 and from third equation 4 to the power x is 2 to the power x square plus 2 to the power x minus 6 is equal to 0 and now if we take 2 to the power x as t then we get t square plus t minus 6 is equal to 0 and now if we add 3 and minus 2 then we get 1 and if we multiply 3 and minus 2 then we get minus 6. So here we get t plus 3 and t minus 2 is equal to 0 and from here we get t is equal to minus 3 or t is equal to 2 and now here t is equal to 2 to the power x t is equal to 2 to the power x that is minus 3 and 2 to the power x is equal to 2 and 2 to the power x is positive and minus 3 is negative so 2 to the power x cannot be equal to minus 3 and from here we get 2 to the power x is equal to 2 to the power 1 or x is equal to 1 so we get 3 value of x x is equal to 2 x is equal to 1 by 2 and x is equal to 1.